We're responding with Mesa PD, patient passed out in a white Chevy Impala. So this patient is breathing. Cool. All right. But they're unconscious. Oh, sleeping. Where everybody's pointing over here. So let's just go ahead and pull them behind them. Keep going. Keep going. Good. Now then? You know where you are? Huh? Can you crawl out on that yeah, side? Why not? What are you sleeping off? Huh? What are you sleeping off? You're tired. Yeah. You know where you are? Yeah. What's your name? Logan. Logan? Yeah. You know what city you're in right now? Okay. What day of the week is it? Uh, How about the month? The month is a, uh, is, uh, scared. Yeah, well, you kind of scared your neighbors. Hey, Logan, uh, don't back up on us. Dude, you guys don't have a right to hold me here. Hey, let's put this in, in, uh... My house is right there. Okay. Cool. Why don't you get up and get out and go to your house then? Okay, I can do that. Shut my door. What's this here? Huh? What's that here? You smoking something? Uh, hey, back up. Talk. Yeah. He's been cool. He's, his first name's Logan. He's been talking with us. <laughs> Logan, just step out, okay? Come on, man. You've been cool with us. Just step out. Yo, yo. Hands on. We're used to calls like this where you don't know exactly what these people are gonna do. If they suddenly become awake, uh, then they try to flee the scene and stuff in a vehicle, it could injure us. So went ahead and came in behind them so it wouldn't be able to leave. We wanna secure that vehicle as soon as we can. You look pale, mister. Yeah, well, there was a big argument, big fight at the house. Yeah? Yeah. We had our, our, our kids were coming to do a visit, and I was up really late cleaning the house till about, oh, yeah. I would say, 7 in the morning. Yeah, let me see your eyes. So what, what drug are you smoking inside your ride there? Huh? What drugs are you smoking in your ride? What drugs was I smoking? Yeah. I hadn't smoked anything yet. He was shoving stuff down here. Here it is. Black tar heroin. Okay. Because he was fidgeting around, shoving stuff under. We looked in the car, we can see uh, immediately micro baggies, which are known for drug paraphernalia. There's also some these plastic straws, of residue, commonly used to inhale heroin. He was kind of groggy, very pale looking. It appeared that he was under the influence. Seems to be good, doing good with uh, all his vital signs. And uh, PD will go ahead and book him and uh, take possession of his vehicle. And that'll be that, he'll go to the jail. <laughs>